and showed them and they said oh my god we can't recognize her it doesn't even look like her she doesn't dress like that when she picks the kids up from school you know who we lynn lim is no ordinary suburban mother she grew up in malaysia and earned degrees in piano and violin and my we and husband brian married 17 years ago and are raising two young kids Seems like family is important. She enjoyed a successful career in the metals oh, industry, God, both before and after having her children. That's my and other than her Malaysian background, Hui's got a lot in common with her fellow suburban parents, except, except her pastime. Competitive ballroom dance. So I had dabbled in dance in the past before, no really formal training. I've been dancing for about six years. I started out as a social dancer. I was, you know, going to all the different avenues in Chicago on during the weekend evenings. I realized that I wanted to do something more challenging. So I decided to go the competitive route. And it turns out Hui's pretty good at the pursuit she just took up six years ago. Along with her professional teacher and partner, Alex Nashev, Hui is winning pro-am ballroom contests for her age in the so-called bronze category. You know, taking dancing away from me basically means, you know, putting me to the graveyard. I, I just love it so much. It's just part of me. Um, I dance every day. So when I'm not dancing with my partner three days a week, I'm dancing by myself. Every dance has a story of its own. So I do 14 different dances and every- You do 14 yes. ballroom dances? Yes. I need to be able to show the different characteristics of all these different dances. When um, people get touched by what they see on the dance floor, and some of them actually even have tears after watching me dance. I think for me, like that's the biggest joy I get is that I was able to touch people emotionally, you know. I, I've gotten so much support from my family. Yeah. What, what happens else? when she wins a medal? I hear something good oh, happens. Money. Oh, when I mean money. So she what wins happens? money. She goes out to the restaurant. Sushi. 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 You know, my kids totally understand it. Uh, especially my daughter. You know, she said to me many times, "Mom, you need this, and I understand you need to be away. We want you to win." I, I see a lot of parents, especially mothers, I think they are so zoned in on their kids, you know, growth, development, all their activities, that I think sometimes they forget about themselves. You know, they give everything up for the kids, which I think is wonderful, but I think at the end of the day, it's very healthy for at least a mother to have something for herself, to be able to, um, you know, show their kids that, hey, I'm also a human being, that I'm just like you, I'm also a student just like you. It doesn't matter how old I am, you know, but if I want to achieve something in life, I have to put in the hard work, there's going to be discipline involved, there's going to be sacrifices, and I think kids can appreciate that. Their last competition in California marked Hui's best performance to date. You know, when we won uh, in Latin, and we also did win in uh, American Rhythm. We came in second in American Smooth. I was just really, really happy, really thrilled. For me, for me, this whole ballroom dance journey is more of a personal accomplishment, you know, knowing that I started later in my life compared to most people. Julie Peterson, Des Plaines, Illinois.